Here are some methods to remove viruses from your computer. First off, how do you get a virus? The most common method is by clicking on a malicious link, either in an email or on the internet. So you're thinking you're going to some link, but it goes to some other link or downloads a file or program. Um, so be careful what you click on. And then how do you know you have a virus? Um, if your computer is running really slowly um, or your internet browser is like redirecting to some weird websites, um, those might be indicators. Um, first thing you can do to check for viruses is you can go to control panel and uninstall a program. And what you want to look for is programs that you don't recognize or that you didn't install. But also make sure it's not a critical program. Um, for example, ones from Microsoft. Don't remove those ones. Um, you can also sort by install date. If you got the virus recently, you can look through the top ones and check if you install that program. If not, you don't think you installed it and it looks um, not safe, you can go uninstall. You can also look online to check to check the verify the program name and company. Um, another thing you can do is if you go into your web browser and then go into settings I'm going to go to extensions this is another common place viruses can appear so make sure you don't have any extensions that are malicious so only extensions that you specifically added to your um, web browser Another thing you can look for is um, under search engine, manage search engines. You want to make sure that there are no other search engines um, listed under here. Um, what viruses might do is um, put their own site here. And then if you search for something, in Google, then it will go to their um, site or domain, and which can like you can lose privacy and track your stuff on your computer. And then, last thing you can do is if you go to advanced and then reset and clean up. Um, you can do reset settings, which will wipe out all um, potential malware or viruses on your web browser. And you wanna make sure you do this, if you have multiple profiles um, across your br browser, for example, Chrome, and you can make other profiles, Make sure you do this for each profile because they might still be, still remain on those other profiles. And then last thing you can do is run a virus or malware scan. There are many available online, just search for them. Um, I personally use Malwarebytes. Um, so here's, it's free. So free um, software is usually good enough. There are premium versions, but the free one is all you need. You can just go scan, and then it will usually close out all your programs and then run a full scan of your computer. And then it will quarantine any viruses or threats um, found on your computer. 
and then if everything else doesn't work, you can think about doing a system restore. Uh, so here, if you press crisp um, system restore, um, this basically reverts your computer to an earlier date. So right here, does not affect any documents, pictures, or personal data, just install programs and drivers. Gives you recommended restore, or you can choose a different restore point. Um, I am only have three days ago, uh, but it might be farther back. You can also do scan for affected programs to see what will get removed. And then last thing, you can do a reset PC, which is last resort. So you'd want to back up your entire computer and then reset this PC to reinstall Windows.